Hi guys, it's Sydney and I'm back with another video. So today I'm gonna be standing in my kitchen and I just wanted to do a little disclaimer. Before we even start this video, if you are under the age of 18, please click out. This is an educational video for people that are over 18, looking to make money and looking to have me as their mentor. So if you're not interested in that, if you're not 18, get out of here. Um, if you are, then hey, Hi, my name's Sydney. If you've never seen my videos before, I've been on YouTube since I was a fetus, basically. <laughs> but today we are actually going to be talking about a new platform that I just found. This video is for educational purposes only, and I just want to make it very clear that number one, you are in control of anything that you want to do, and you don't have to post anything on this platform that you don't want to post. So please keep that in mind when you're watching this and understand that I may be posting what I want to post and you can post whatever you want to post. There is no gatekeeper to what you're doing. Before we get fully into it, a little background on me. Um, if you guys are new and you've never seen a video before, you've never seen one of my other tip videos, I have a lot of tip videos in general, my OnlyFans tips. So I am top 0.08% I'm one of the top creators, you guys, on OnlyFans. I have been able to have a lot of amazing things happen because of OnlyFans. So I just want to say that, like, I really love what I do. And this platform that I just found is something that I really feel like is the future. And I feel like it is the next step. OnlyFans has been having a lot of problems. And people have been trying to find a place for the creators to go. And I really feel like this is the place. And I feel like this is the future. It's newer. And the other thing too, the one of the big things is it was created by a fellow sex worker. So if you do OnlyFans, whether you're doing content that's new to you or not, you are considered a sex worker. That is still a sex worker platform no matter what you say. I promise you, if you're selling pictures of yourself, you're a sex worker. Even if you're not in full service sex work, I'm not. Even if you're not, I'm still one too. So please understand that that word is a very broad umbrella and a lot of people fit underneath it. And this person, created, I think her name's Sasha, and then I think L created Frisk. This is the platform I'm going to be talking about today, and I really think that it's an amazing opportunity. I see it as the future. I want you to be part of it. I want you to see the future. I created my profile five hours ago, and since then, I never rush videos, okay? I'm never one to be like, I need to get my camera out. I need to post this tonight, but I'm doing this because I know that this is important. I know this is something that, like, if you have been on the fence about creating an OnlyFans and you haven't yet, I think it's going to be better than OnlyFans, honestly. I really do. There's probably gonna be growing pain. I really feel like this platform is going to be amazing I feel like it's the next big thing. I have a referral code I will be making if you sign up if you sign up under my referral code rather than going off on your own Making an account by yourself without help. You'll have me my group chat of amazing referral girls that I have and you'll have my secret tip videos and you'll also so you get four amazing perks get shout out by me so one of the biggest things I want to say is I have been mentoring for about two years now I started my OnlyFans back in November of 2018 I haven't looked back since it's been an amazing journey it's been something that's awesome but I'm gonna be using both so people that aren't using my OnlyFans or can't use it Frisk is going to be an option I just want to make it clear that I know it's hard to start I want to help you when you create Create your account under my referral which I will have the steps right here be sure that you send me an email okay my email is info at fitsid.com I'll have everything in the description too but follow those and you'll be able to get my help and it'll be an amazing journey for you everyone that's under my referral right now um, hopefully loves it I mentor so many people it's just crazy how like all of us are so different but come together all because of one platform and this new platform Frisk I feel like is going to be the next big thing I created my account very 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 recently today I've been exploring it since then literally you guys I was working out on my little peloton and I was like oh my god give me my workout in but then I was looking at Frisk and I was figuring it out and it's awesome it's literally it has what I want and that's the best thing so if you're a model if you're a content creator if you are looking for something new and you don't like OnlyFans or you don't have that platform where like people will just subscribe to you this is the perfect opportunity for you if you're looking for my help as well this is also the perfect opportunity for you having my help rather than not having my help I feel like would be very beneficial but you can make your own decision I I was so excited about this I didn't even clean okay normally I at least pick up after myself but this was something that I felt like was so important that I just needed to get the video out there I'll have my referral link down below I'll have it written on the screen all you do after you create it a couple steps okay Open a new tab. I know you're watching this maybe on your phone or you're watching this on your computer. Open a new tab, copy the link, and paste it. 
Once you do that, create your account instantly after that. Do not wait because when you do that and it refreshes, it will not keep my referral code link there, if that makes sense. So if you really want my help, that's important. Then once you're done creating it and you've like filled it out and submitted your IDs, email me. I'm gonna be checking my emails. I check them every day, but I'm gonna be checking them a lot more right now because I want to help. And I know this is the next big thing. I know this is gonna be amazing for people that are struggling right now during COVID. I know that a lot of people want to do this, but they're scared, they don't have help. You know, I'm here for you, I got this. Like, I've been doing this for two years and I know how hard it is. I started from the bottom and now I'm here. On my OnlyFans top 0.08%, so obviously I've worked my booty off to get there, but I also know how to market and I know how to do things. So hopefully this is helpful. I wanna make it very clear, you guys, I'm still using OnlyFans. I love OnlyFans, but I do feel like OnlyFans is having a lot of problems recently and it, that's why I've been looking for another platform. A lot of the other ones didn't cut it for me, but this one for some reason spoke to me so much that I'm gonna make this video. So if that says anything, I never get this excited where I'm like, ooh, you know? All right, so I'm going to screen record my phone and make a new account and show you guys how the process works. What I'm gonna do is I'm literally gonna visit my copied link and that says sign up with for a free creator account goes directly to it. So you need to make sure that you sign up right then and there. So I'm gonna type in a random email, I'm gonna type in a password, profile URL, click start earning now. But it doesn't stop there, okay? So once you hit start earning now, you are going to upload a picture and upload a banner. So the banner, the middle part of the banner picture is going to be like the square. So this part right here is gonna show and the rest of it won't show on mobile, but the rest will on a desktop, if that makes sense. So just understand that you have to do that. Um, then you make a display name. I go by Fit Sid and Fit Sydney, so I would type in Fit Sid. And then it says sexually explicit content is not permitted on profile pictures. So keep your po profile picture and your banner PG. Then it says, however, very sexy images are allowed. So no need to cover up in winter knits. This is frisky frisk after all. So just understand that you can't have explicit content or nudes. Um, next, it says profile info, display name, age, which I don't know if you can lie about your age or not, but I put my real age on mine and then my location I put was bedroom, Twitter, Instagram, and you put those handles. That's awesome because OnlyFans doesn't really let you promote your socials, so it's nice that um, they actually allow that. Next is, next is write a brief description letting your fans know who you are, a little more about you, entice your fans to subscribe by letting your fans know what you're offering if they join. Personally for me, Mine's basically my Twitter bio because that's kind of what I use for everything. It explains me and um, yeah. So once you do that, you click final step. I'm not gonna show the rest, but basically final step is when you submit your IDs. So you take your ID, take a picture. I would highly recommend doing it on like a blank surface like this. So putting your ID on this, take a picture, make sure it's light and bright. And then you have to take a light and bright picture holding your ID. This is something that's very common for, it's actually like required for any platform. So just understand that that's not like weird that they're asking for that. But you need to make sure the best way to get approved quickly is having clear photo, a bright photo that's like not dark and hard to read. And then also don't take it selfie style. I always flip my camera and take my picture like this. That way it's very easy for me to like have it clear highest quality and it's not gonna flip the ID picture if that makes sense. So hopefully that helped you out. That's the starting process. In my opinion, I like to keep my stuff simple and classy so just understand that like when you're looking at my profile, maybe you might not think it's simple and classy but like kind of what I'm trying to go for. Um, if you're having trouble, think simple and classy and PG. Then you wanna pick an easy name. If you already have social medias like linked to stuff and you want to use that name, you can. Understand that if you're creating this account, it has a stigma behind it. It's just like OnlyFans, so you wanna make sure that you're gonna be okay with using that username and display name. If you wanna start fresh, you totally can, but make sure you have social medias that are like similar to it and connected. You can make completely new ones um, to promote it if you're brand new. Choosing your sub price. So my sub price on OnlyFans is $35. I'm going to make mine the same on Frisk. They take the same percentage, which is 20%, um, which is actually really good. 
many vids which is like a clip site for clips they take 40% so that's a lot um so I think 20% is awesome keep in mind there's a free site so your sub price is your VIP like exclusive stuff so you don't need to charge five dollars like if you want to you can but if you want to make it so everyone gets everything that's why I do my $35 price and that's just how I do it next is when you're starting out you don't need to have the perfect bio but eventually think about it think about how you want to present yourself on the internet I know that sometimes people struggle with writing bios so once you've gone through all that process of filling that whole approval section out once you get approved it took me only like five hours to get approved I know that like they wake up and go to bed and you know like not someone's probably not working all the time while you're waiting to be approved make sure you post on your free and your paid side so there's two sides the side where they pay to see your stuff and the free wall so there's two different walls you can make one or two posts now and then schedule stuff so while you're waiting to be approved you can take that time to do that once you're approved schedule as much as possible that way you're not having to sit there and like always be on your phone to schedule explore the site a little better you know for me I'm just now getting to explore the site but I feel like I already know it pretty well because I've sat down for like a couple hours and I really explored the site I checked every button every tab and it's very helpful to do that because then you'll be you're your own boss when you do this like no one's gonna hold you accountable and your fans might get pissed off if you don't know how to use the site properly so make sure to take some time click on all the buttons know what they do and uh it takes time but at the same time like when you sit there and actually like touch things on the site and actually like explore it you'll know it way better than most next thing is fill out your banking info i did that and i was so glad i did because once i was approved i have nothing i have to do like i've done all these things go into your settings while you're exploring the site and explore what you can fill out there's connecting your socials and linking your Twitter adding your wish list and you can even take your time while you're waiting to be approved to make a wish list on Amazon add the link onto there because it's awesome because it comes up right on your profile and then the last thing is your welcome videos you need to keep that PG and non explicit um you can go and see what mine is biggest thing I want to say is like you can do a selfie style one where you're just like this like hey guys my name's blah blah this is what you expect from my site just welcoming them like you don't have to have a high quality crazy video like you can literally just pull out your phone stand by a window and make it and you don't have to have it originally but like the sooner the better that way you don't forget to do it and then after your welcome video if you're looking and you don't have any content to start start creating content um if you're under my referral just know that I will help you figure out like how you're going to kind of navigate and we can hopefully help you brand yourself because I know how hard that is. Yeah, you'll be part of a great community of women who and even men and non-binary people who are just amazing. If you are rude, malicious, or making people uncomfortable in the chat, you could get kicked out, but I've never had to do that. I just wanna make that very clear because I don't owe anyone anything, but I do want you to know that like, I wanna help as many people as possible, so if you make an account, you have the opportunity to have this amazing community. This platform really does what I do think it's genuinely gonna do, and if you don't wanna regret it, make an account, and even if it takes you a while to get started, just know that I think it's gonna be big. So with that being said, you guys, my referral link's gonna be down below. I will probably make an updated video with this eventually, um, but I always make tip videos for the people in my referral that are much more in depth and explaining things that I can't do on YouTube. Um, so yeah, so I hope that you guys love this video. Please know that if it's not for you, it's not for you. And if you're not interested, you're not, but I'm glad that you watched. And if you guys could give this video a like, and if you have any friends that you think would enjoy this as well, share it with them. And yeah, I appreciate you guys so much. And I'm just so excited about this that I had to make the video and now I'm gonna sit down, edit it, and post it. So I love you guys so much. I am so appreciative. And I just want you guys to know that I see big things coming with this and I wanted to make you guys aware as soon as possible because I just have a really good feeling about this. So I love you guys. Thank you. Have fun. Be safe. Good night. Sweet dreams. Mwah. Baby Yoro says mwah. I love you. Mwah.